In this video, I'm going to show you how to convert WebP images into JPEG images using a simple Google Chrome plugin. So let's go. So to demonstrate this, I'm going to show you using the Stewie's Greetings website. So normally when you go to an image on the web, you, you're able to hit save image as, and then you would see several options here. Um, to save it as or you would see the option to save it in the file format that that original image was in so if it was in a gif then you will save it as a gif if it was a png you will save it as a png if it was in jpeg you will save it as jpeg but what we can see here is the only option that we have here rather is to save it as a webp file and that poses some problems for example in my case i use photoshop a lot and when I download an image in Web, WebP file format, I'm unable to actually put it in Photoshop and, you know, use it, manipulate it, and, and do, do whatever I want with it. What I've done is I've installed a simple Chrome plugin that allows me to save it in JPEG, PNG, and I think WebP file format. So let me show you how that works. So in, to install this, what you'll need to do is go to, go to Google, And then you're going to search save image. So save image as type Chrome extension. The first link that you see should be the one that you're working with. So of course, ensure that it's going to the Chrome, the Google Chrome website. So chrome.google.com, save image as type, click it. And of course, you'll be looking for the plugin or extension that has this icon. So this square with a dot and what looks like a somewhat of a triangle. So of course I already have it installed, but you can go ahead and install it. So once you have it installed in Chrome, all you need to do now is right click the image that you want to save. So instead of save image as, you'll see this new option come up with the logo for the extension um, right next to it. So save image as type. So you get the option to save it as a JPEG, a PNG, WebP image. So let's save it as a JPEG image. So as you can see here, save as type JPEG image. And then in my downloads folder, hit save. So now I have full access to this image as usual. I can bring it over into Photoshop. I can do whatever I want with it. So if this video helped, of course, be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, and of course, drop us a comment if you have any questions, comments, thoughts, we'd love to hear from you. And by the way, this channel is all about the creative entrepreneurs. So we share everything about marketing, digital marketing, Facebook advertising, some design, Photoshop, you name it. So if you're into these kind of things, just the skills that you need to be a digital entrepreneur, be sure to subscribe to this channel. And until next time, peace out. Take care.